the 15th, so that could only mean one thing. It's opening night. Oh, God, I'm making myself dizzy. Woo! <laughs> it's opening night, and I'm so, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Like, super excited. Like, not nervous at all. I'm normally nervous this time for opening night and then once opening night's done that's it i'm fine but i'm super excited so that's a good thing right that's a bonus so yes <coughs> so my hair's done just got plaited um but i'm having a bit of a oh no i'll clip it up somewhere i'm having a bit of a problem I've got heartburn, right? <laughs> and I've had heartburn since one o'clock. It's half three now and it's not going. I'm a little worried. <laughs> I don't know, maybe it's my body seeing that in your head you're not nervous, but your body's nervous. Maybe that's what it is. But I think it's because I've been drinking a lot of pop the past couple of days. Diet, diet. But it doesn't make a difference, like the carbohydrate water, the fizziness gives you heartburn, the acid or whatever. And I've had peppermint tea. Didn't work. I've had, um, I've tried chewing, chewing gum. Didn't work. I've tried even Gaviscon. Hasn't worked. So I went on the internet and it was like, Stand up straight. How does standing up straight get rid of heartburn? I don't understand. Keep away from smoking. I don't want to smoke. And then one of the other options was try sipping apple cider vinegar. Conveniently, I had it in my cupboard. So I was like, it's not going to taste pleasant, but I may as well give it a try. And if worse comes to worse, What's it? Is it worse come the worst? Push come the shove. I don't know what I'm saying. And I don't, it doesn't go by showtime. I'll have to just suck her up and get on with it. But yes, I mean, it's not like painful as if it's going to put us off, but it's, it's not, it's discomfort. It's discomfort. So I want to try to get rid of it. So yes, so I've got to do on my makeup. My makeup takes about half an hour. To do so not that long maybe it's even not even that but um yes and then when i get to the theater i put my nose on and paint my lips a lot and obviously get my costume on. <laughs> but yes so i've got to be at the theater for like six and something i decided to do yesterday for dress rehearsal was leave my stuff there like, not my makeup, because I like to put my makeup on before I get um, to the place so all I need to do is put my costume on. But I've left some eyeshadow there so I can do my nose. And I've left my lipstick there. I've left my dance shoes there. I've left snacks there. I've left deodorants there. I've left perfume there. And it's like, I'm thinking... At least I won't have to lob about a bag because the last time I did the show I had my backpack and obviously I bring everything with us and take it back home but people were like not like I was a principal or anything but people were like oh your mum's getting a phone call do 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 boo do do boo do boo boo do Okay, so um yeah, so but like people are waiting there, family waits there, people see all oh, well done for doing a good job at being in chorus or dancing or but I've got a line like I say it's in a, it might just be a line but I'm trying to give me all into that line. Like, I'm trying to do it. <laughs> so, yes, but it doesn't matter what role you got. Everyone's like, well done and congratulations. Some people pat you on the back. Some people even give you a hug. But um, my backpack was, like, 
bashing people. So I thought, oh, well, if I leave stuff there, all I need to take is a drink. Think and ahead. So I'm going to do my makeup now, even though it's only half free, but that will take us to four. Then I can just chill. I can chill. So my makeup is done. All I need to do is my nose. So we're heading off now because I need to be there for like six, quarter past six. So I have time for to get my costume on. But me and mum are popping to Morrison's to see if I can get something for this hot room because it still hasn't gone. It's better. But it's still there, and I would rather it just be gone completely. But also, guys, I must be the most stupidest person that I know. So me and my friends that have a group chat, that like some some members of Jeremy School Theatre Company will have a group chat. And Philip works at a go kart. I've been calling it goat, goat cart, goat cart, for God knows how long, goat cart. Why? How? How? how why? Why goat cart? It's go cart. It's, it's go cart. Costume on, a nose is on, flogging on. Oh, um, practically. I'm going to show you my. What would you call this? A station? Show you my station. No. So the young ones are still. <laughs> Yes, but this needs, this, need all this own. needs the mirror. You need your the young station. ones have saw the mirrors, basically. Uh, Amy's coming over into my workstation. How rude. This is part of my costume. Yes. I'll not show you over there because Danielle's got her tatties out. It's of Shay. Burlesque. Is there a reason you're in my mirror? <laughs> Don't break it now. Don't break it. I need that. <laughs> be in the vlog. She wants to be in the vlog. There you go. <laughs> what? Well, that's a line because everyone likes me. Hello. Hello. Whatever. Hello. Whatever. Hello. 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 <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, I'll turn the sick one. It's not Pat though. Who's Pat? Not a clue. How do you say I love you in French? Not a clue. Te amo is I love you in Spanish and yeah. Italian, but what's French? Je do. Je do. Hi. Love you all. Break a leg. <laughs> Nailed that. Oi. No 
fighting. Oi. No fighting. Picky blinders. Picky blinders. Picky blinders. Have you seen picky blinders? School with. So you don't know who Thomas Shelby is? Yeah. School with. I'm sweating. I'm sweating. My pants are falling down. It's not funny. Come downstairs, Jordan rips off me tail. Disgraceful. Yes, I'm talking about you. Yes, you did. You stood on me tail. No, you're lying. You're lying. I'm a lady rabbit, so I don't need bushy eyebrows. Oh, it's quite good light on that, actually. So good, a little shout out to Francis. Poor little Francis had a migraine and Anna was like to have a migraine so God knows what she must have been feeling tonight. So painful I can only imagine. Oh my goodness, poor thing. But she went on, she went on, she sang all the songs, she knew all the words. She nailed it and she did an amazing job, so I told her that. You know what? You're a freaking troop. Well, I said this way, word. Um, trooper, and I admire you for that. And I give her a kiss on the cheek, but then everybody wanted a kiss on the cheek then. But honestly, well done, Francis. You're a little star. You're a little gem. So I guess I'll see you. I'll see. I look a bit pale, don't I? Do you reckon? I haven't got makeup on. I've washed it off now. Even all the lipstick between my teeth. But that's what I do before I leave the dressing room. Get change, spray that and wipe my makeup off. But, I mean, I look, my skin looks nice and clear. I've still got a bit of what my nose. <laughs> um, but yeah. I'll see you tomorrow. Well, today. So I'm not going to carry on that conversation while Shannon's vlogging. Oh, sorry! It's alright. How is it every time I'm vlogging you've got to say something inappropriate? I'm always saying something inappropriate. But this is why we love you. By the way, if you didn't get it, Francis is better now. Francis is better now. Just don't turn your camera around because I need to get dressed. Oh, okay. right, okay. <laughs> so what's the deal? <laughs> well, you can't see you. Yeah. Anyway. Yes, you um, excuse secrets. me, but I'm the star of this channel, so oh, no one needs to see your see face. Your own, you know, <laughs> right. What's the date the day of the 16th? First day of the 16th, second show. Got ready. Little bit of little story. Well, it's not really a story, but it's what I did before rehearsals. I watched. Has anybody seen Wine Country? Yes, no. I watched it last it's night. It's really good, isn't it? Because Alfie watched it himself ah. on the afternoon, and then he wanted Alfie. me to watch it again with him. Alfie what? watched it himself? Yes. It's kind of like a woman's film, yes. not being sexist. <laughs> not being sexist. He watches Jane the Virgin. He watches Jane the Virgin. And hey, this non-binary is offended by that comment. <laughs> I said non-sexist. <laughs> But yeah, he likes bad he and likes bad ha Francis six so musical. Have you heard of it? Oh, yes, listen to the whole track for the first time today. Oh, mate, I've been listening to it because I saw the Olivia. Is it Ol Olive Oliver Awards? Olivia, Olivia, Olivia Awards. Olivia. Yes, their performance popped up on my YouTube, and I was like, oh, that's interesting. I've heard that before. So good. It's so good. And I didn't even know what it was about, but it's about the Henry VIII's wife. I have only got into that like a month ago. The revamped modern twist. There we are. Go give it a little listen. I'll see you later. Guys, the struggle. The struggle is real. The story is in Balamori. 
and pants for store to use pants. Or too uh, bloody big on the waist, so they keep falling down. My bum's out of the pants, that's what's happening. It's a good job I was wearing shorts. So anyway, I thought, oh, I'll get the braces, I'll put the braces on. But the braces didn't work because it came off and lashed us in the back. So then, me wife, this is me wife. I rescued her. This is me wife. We decided to get married. She confessed her love to us. I just need to tell me boyfriend. Yeah. Be fair and better look. I'm sexy out. And I'm more funny out. I'm a mother effing smoke. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Tom, I'm Thomas Shelby of Stoats, that's who I am. But yes, so she saved us and she's bobbled me pants. So hopefully this works. If not, I'll have to just stick with my pants falling down. Well, that's another showdown. I'm so hot and violent. I'm violent and I'm so tired now. Two shows in. Technically it's free because it's my dress rehearsal on Tuesday. <sighs> but now I'm getting tired. But we've only got three shows left. But I'm loving it. I'm not complaining. I'm not complaining. I love it. But I'm tired. I'm tired. Me tired. Me tired. So yes. But the show went really well today. It was an accident. So... <laughs> Um, one of my parts is to push, because I'm a rabbit and I'm a lady rabbit. So the other rabbits are like footmen, but the other footmen, because there's supposed to be four footmen, the other footman, Helen, plays a horse, so I have to step in. I'm still, I'm not in a footman's dress, I'm the lady rabbit, so it's like as if I'm the boss, right? So... There's a part where Toad has a caravan and we bring this caravan on. It's like a gypsy's caravan. Bring this on. And you've got to get on as fast as you can. And there's like four for pushing this on. But the um the side curtains, the blacks, the side curtains got caught on top of the caravan. So I pulled it off in my hat flew off almost strangled myself because it's a bonnet almost strangled myself and put it back on <laughs> the audience were laughing <laughs> so i was like oh i'm gonna burst out i'm gonna burst out laughing here uh what was it it was such a great like an amazing crowd tonight they were so supportive and so cheerful and i seen last night where when supportive, they were cheering and we were grateful for that. But tonight they were like, probably like shouting. And we agreed um, in rehearsals and dress rehearsals, Michelle says, um, depending on the crowd, we'll either keep the, um, after the final bow, because we'll sing two more songs and we'll take a bow together. And if the, cr if the crowd's loud, we'll keep the curtains open and then you can do another bow and a little boogie. So we kept the curtains open the night, which was nice. So yes, keep on coming, the great audience. Keep them coming, yes. Very good. <laughs> I don't know if you noticed, but I've got like black. A black dots on my nose, my paws are blocked up with pain. I can't get them out. I've tried squeezing them. I've tried scrubbing them, I've tried rubbing it hard with a makeup wipe and it's not coming off and I keep looking that way when I should be looking that way. I'm sorry. So yeah, but I'll see you tomorrow for Friday's bird show. Oh, it's recording! Is that it? No, no. Little Moni? Hey!
said it. Why is it you? you what do you want from why me? Why is it when you're over there you never shut up, but now when you're on video you go? Mm. Don't test. Punch on the face. Well. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, I do well, love I think you. She wants an insight of the conversation. <laughs> <laughs> no. No, nobody wants that. Not, not, not safe for you. Nobody wants, nobody wants to hear that. Wait, which bit? Any of it? Any of it? Did you have to stop? Shut my house up. I recorded yesterday because mm. the conversation. Oh, you're oh, wow. You have just got a knack for like picking up the most inappropriate. Yeah, moments. literally. Yeah. But Fran, what? I do love you. Thanks, love you too. Oh, and it's ah! the first time. And the first time you've done a fat the words. Today it is. I've said it to you. It's before. normally the other language. I get it. What? You don't get the, 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 that. You don't get that. Uh, smiling. It's demonetized for everything else. Mm -hmm. <laughs> getting your boobies out. You want to see them? I'll put my boobies away then. Yeah. What time is it? Anybody? It's, it's time for you to go. On, right, I need to go. It's time for you to go and sleep on the stage. Yeah, it is. Man. Have a good show, lovelies. Bring a leg. Bye. Bye. Improvement. Didn't have to pull my pants up. The sweaty buggers. We sweat and we stink. And if you come near us, you know that we rink. <laughs> the sweaty buggers. We sweat and we stink. And if you come near us, you know that we rink. <laughs> you've ever seen. <laughs> 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 MC Wood on that mic. You know who you look like? Brian May. Did you, did you see him fall the day? Yeah, he almost fell. He like, <laughs> fell the day he was trying to pick up the ball for cricket and he was just like slow motion off the stage. <laughs> If you want to say that, you need to give you a channel. Philip's been some of the double L's built with a C. Apart from me, you're like an apple. I'm not sitting like I've got piles. Computer apple. apple. I'm not sitting like I've got piles because I've got a tail. And this tail contains a pin. I haven't got, I haven't got a tail. Mine keeps on falling off. Joe and Francis. Oh go on. In in the wings. I'm trying to, and I was like I couldn't control me that. She's face oh. <laughs> so, it's not a photo. <laughs> Why does everyone do that? <laughs> Because you didn't see.
Funny story time. Story in Palamori. Right. Last. Oh. Give me up the carrot. Right, you can't be him. Can you sing up? Can you use it all in Wildwood as, I don't know if you were holding back a bit or out? Was very quiet. Uh -huh. Just yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Better could hear you. Yeah, we haven't got those ones on, you see, when you're in the chorus. Mm -hmm. All the, there's only the principal's ones on. Yeah. 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 Yours was on. The director has spoken. Anyways, before I was rudely interrupted. <laughs> so, last of Act One, the final, the final, the final of Act One. We've got popcorn on at the court scene, right? So Philip turns to us and says, "Oh, we haven't got the popcorn." So it's like, "Oh, I'll get it." I sneak behind the back curtain like this. I guess to the other side and I goes, when I get the popcorn. So she goes off and she comes back and she sees the popcorn's already over there. So I sneak back and I couldn't get back with laughing. Karen the prop lady was just like Hello everybody. This is old Farty Badger. <laughs> no, no, not a Farty. Arty Badger. Arty. Arty Badger. Yeah. Loving every minute of wind in the willows. Oh, wind. That reminds me of Farty. <laughs> oh, and I haven't had a drink since Shannon's wonderful evening last Saturday night. So glamour and glitz. So everybody watching this should subscribe to yeah. her trip to Uganda. That's she'll, she'll tell you more and more and more about the wonderful work that's done through the collection. So anybody who's got any loose change and wants to donate to Shannon, the rules are you fold it up very carefully and put it into the box. You've heard Bye. it. Bye. You've heard of them better. Come on, boys and girls, let's this get on the cutest thing I've ever seen. Yeah, the hoodie. Yeah, the hoodie. So, it is Saturday morning, and today we have two shows. We have a one o'clock matinee show, and then we have a show at 5.30. I quite like these um, shows, when you've got two shows, even though you're not good, because one show is a day is enough. So wrap your out but I quite like it because you get to have like that hour and a half break for your lunch and everyone just sits together and has a chat and like I mentioned through the, the um, video that we all family so it's like family time you just have a little sit and eat food and have a little nap and it's lovely so yes, but I'm going to do my makeup at the theatre for the first time um, because I've got to do some errands before I go there. I'm going to get to the theatre about 12 so I can do my makeup. Also, also, um, as I mentioned in yesterday's video, Miss Frances Wood and Joe Coulson putting us off on me wee bit song Welcome to the Mansion and they're in the side wings going and so Joe comes up to us and he starts telling us this joke of what this means, right? So I'm gonna try to get him to do it to a day because it was funny. <laughs> the laughs you have, the laughs you have. So yes. I'm going to go get some new glasses, guys, and then I'm going to the bank because this girl is broke so I need to sort see something out see. <laughs> new glasses. I don't know if I like them. <laughs> I say this every time I get a new pair of glasses. I don't know if I like them because it shows too much of my face. 
And compared to the other ones, wait there, let us just show you. These look as if they cut up my face a little bit, if that makes sense. Maybe this is because of the dark rim. But with this being so light, I don't know. Maybe I'll wear them today, see if I get compliments. And if people will be like, ooh, they're new glasses. Because you can tell, because even like friends, if you were a true friend, they would say, yes, they don't suit you. But friends that are just like friends, well, not f just friends, but people that are too nice, not too nice. What am I trying to say? Because I don't want to offend people. People that don't want to hurt your feelings will say, oh yeah, they're nice. But you can tell in the tone of the voice instead of like, oh, you suit them glasses, they're really nice. They'll be like, oh yeah, they're nice, yeah, you suit them. So if I hear them, then I'll be like, right, sorry, back to the opticians, I'll get some new glasses, some different ones. But yeah, I'm going to wear these and see what happens I might look different with my makeup on but yeah see what happens so I'm here early so I thought sorry if you get copyrighted I do um, excuse me I don't want to get copyrighted this has happened to me before what's the song called just in case it's called beautiful by Carrie there we are right I'm going to do a tour out of the stage if I'm allowed it's a boot Messing about on the river. Where's it? Where's it? Where's it? My oh my! This is the caravan. We've got to push. Wait there. Yeah. Go back. Go back. There we are. So we're on stage because I think I'm talking to myself. This is the entrance to Toad. He's a little motorcar. This pit for the band. There's the audience. Hello, audience. Give us a wave. Yes. This is a little. I haven't been on this yet, so I'm gonna go up. Oh, it's not as sturdy as I thought it would be. Oh. Oh, I don't like that. Don't like it. Get down. Leaning down the street Did you see that handsome chap In the driving seat Motor and amphibian A minute work of art Both decides To never be apart This is little Mill's house This is where Joe falls off a lot But just Oh I don't like it on there It doesn't feel sturdy this is one of my favourite props, right? This chair. How cool is that chair? That's his badger's. Badger's house. And that's where him all trips up on. Oh, scratch myself. I went up there and it doesn't feel safe. Look at this curtain, though. Look at the curtain. How cool is that curtain? What else? Oh, I haven't showed the trains yet. Yes. Broom. Do you remember Broom? Broom. I want to get in one. Yeah, it's the little trains. It's Mr. Toad. Boop, boop. Toad. Boop, boop. <laughs> He's a little shovel. That's the favourite part of the show. There's a song called Mr. Toad. Boop, boop. And David's in a call who plays Toad. And at the beginning, once the curtain, he's sitting on the stage in his car, and the curtain opens, and all he does is this. <laughs> <laughs> it's a funny thing. <laughs> <laughs> um, ow, 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 
What's that? What's the favorite line? Do you think you can jump? Are you mad? Jump from this? Absolutely not. This was the curtain we I creep behind yesterday. I don't have to, have to right now we've got to get down without killing myself. Dressing room, boys dressing room. This is Badger's wig. How have you got a fan? We've got two. Where did you get these from? Because I complained and complained until someone brought them in. That one, the little one's mine. The big one. Oh, that so one jealous. Of Phil Martin. I complained so and complained jealous. until someone brought them in because I was too hot. You yeah, are oh, a bit of a drama. Lighting all oh, this lighting all oh, this lighting. Yes, queen. Yes. yes. Lighting all oh, this lighting all oh, this lighting. Yes, queen. Yes. yes. The best thing just happened. Francis confesses her love to us. <laughs> Well, while, she's out, while she's out of the room, I didn't do it to her face. <laughs> I goes to the toilet. I'll just blur it out, shall I? I goes to the toilet and I was like, yes, Francis, you know what? I love her, you know. And I goes, you know what? I ever love you. <laughs> for the toilet window. And then all she says is, her on the floor. <laughs> Isn't that nice? She can't see it behind my back, but she can't see it in my face. <laughs> I just get F off. I don't want to get the big head, that's all it is. She did tell us that she loved us yesterday. She did. She does tell us a lot. Yes. And I love her too. You stop it. You're going to make us cry. Oh, God, no, no. I've got photographs the last show. I've got photographic proof that it happened as well. <laughs> but you didn't record it. I did. I've just, sent, I've just sent you it. Oh wait. He did it in portrait mode. I don't. Yeah. Um, you have to do both of them. What do you call this? It's a, it's a vicious circle. What do you call these? Ah! Ah! Terrorists. Oh, hey. Whoa. Terrorists. <laughs> so, guys, apparently I've been seeing me lines wrong. I'm supposed to be slapping Jim and saying, why are you so feeble? Must I do everything in this family? But apparently I've been saying, why are you so useless? Must I be doing everything in this family? It's still true though, isn't it, Meanie? Yeah, Yeah. Well, it's the last show. It's the last show, lads. I think I'm gonna cry. Jordan's already cried. And the last one. Well, I'll be gone. They'll have to pick off the floor. <laughs> what do you want to tell you vloggers? I'm dying. I'm dying. So here's Mr. Todd. <laughs> Hello everyone. Now I do hope you're supporting Shannon in her efforts to help the little old kitty wings of uh, Uganda. She's done a sterling job. And we're very grateful for the Ugandans for having her. <laughs> now, do your bit. Get your pockets, get your purses, and give, give, give for a very good cause. See you later. Bye bye. I'm dying, right? And Brittany just comes in a few years and I'm lying on the floor looking like the matchmaker from Mulan. Get your tail out, me camera. <laughs> Already cried. Already cried. God knows what. Finale's gonna look like. 
I'll be on the floor. I'll come to the dressing room and I'll be on the floor again. So that's the show over. I did cry. I had a good old cry, like a really good cry. It was ridiculous, like on the stage. Like after the last show, you always like congratulate people and stuff and there's like a speech and like the chairman does the thank you speeches and stuff like that talk about the next show and stuff like that but you just give people hugs like i said in, the in this video i don't know i said it you're just family you're family so you just you're just grateful for them i'm so grateful for them and uh, i mean when the show week sometimes i'm not gonna lie some of them do me head in, but I still love them and that's not going to change. And I just think that are an amazing group of people and they're so talented and I do adore them and I love them very, very much. So I'm going to cry after the show because you put so much hard work into it. So much hard work, like hours and hours of work into this show and for it to be over like that like you spend months and months on working on one show and then it's over within five days it's just crazy but i've i've enjoyed every moment i've loved every moment and this is definitely by far one of my favorite um shows so far but yes and oh, it's that song as well a friend is still a friend and if you haven't seen um Wind in the Willows, you need to go check it out online or whatever, or stream it, get the DVD, or even just listen to the music on Spotify because the music is just so good, it's so beautiful. And A Friend is Still a Friend or Please to Come Back, it was definitely my favourite songs through the whole show, even though they're not the songs that I'm in. If I had to play um, an ensemble song, I do love where the wild wood is or taking over the hall. Yes. But yes, it's been an amazing show, amazing show. Full of amazing people and I do love them all. So yes, yes to Panto, Jack and the Beanstalk, get your tickets. I shall keep you updated once the tickets go live. I shall let you know. But yes, and thank you so much to the um, the cast members that have been trying to help out with my trip to Uganda. I am going to Uganda in summertime to do some more volunteering with the Girls Brigade to work on, work alongside a charity called Fields for Life, which helps um, teach children. And also they're working on a project called I Am Girl, that which um, helps to teach not just girls but boys about periods because in that in africa they don't really know what periods are because they're not taught about it so the like the, the stories that you hear it's just it's insane girls don't know about the periods the thing that they're dying because of periods the way that they try to deal with periods it's just and there's no one there to help them and they're just the they're dropping out of school because they're, they're getting mocked because of um, blood stains and stuff like that. And it's just it's just mental. So we're going to try there to put a stop to that and educate people on periods. And also just to educate kids in general. Also, we're going to be um, working to try to put some fountains in the water pumps so we can supply some fresh water. But it's going to be an amazing trip. So, yes. Um, uh, follow me on social media to, if you want to help out to raise money. I will be doing events and competitions to try to raise money. So, yeah. So, thank you so much because I never asked them to do that. I never asked them to do that at all and they did it and it means a lot to us. And, yes. See what I mean? The family. And I do love them so, so much. And they've helped us so much with my trip as well. So, I can't thank them enough. But yes, I'm going to go before I start crying again. Um, so yes, don't be done. Click that fun, be gentle, share with your friends. And I shall see you next time. Mm -hmm.